All right. Hello to anyone out there. It's good to see everyone. I'm going to be playing Tales of Symphonia for the first time. Um, personally, I watched my big brother play when I was little. I've played Tales of Vesperia, Tales of um, Tales of the Abyss, and Tales of Fantasia before, but I've never personally played this one, and it happens to be one of my favorite games, even though I've never personally played it. I played bits, and I played it with him because you know it's two player. But um, yeah, I'm actually really excited to get into this today. Um, I've always wanted to play this game through by myself. Um, here we go. Let's just get right into it. Bring that back. Alrighty then. Let's see. I'll make sure everything's a go first, real quick. Oh yeah, I wanted to watch. <laughs> Just get right into it. New game, baby. Change game settings. Not on your life. Once upon a time, there existed a giant tree that was the source of mana. Is it called Yggdrasil? A war, however, caused this tree to wither away, and a hero's life was sacrificed in order to take its place. Grieving over the loss, the goddess disappeared unto the heavens. The goddess left the angels with this edict. You must wake me, for if I should sleep, the world shall be destroyed. Good lord, what a fate. The angels bore the chosen one, who headed towards the tower that reached up to the heavens and that marked the beginning of the regeneration of the world this is cool it's zooming in to like where we are i love that lloyd irving wake up she's gonna use my whole government on me so like look at my boy lloyd sleeping standing up but it's like how do you manage to sleep standing? She only mentions that he's sleeping standing. She doesn't mention the two full buckets of water that are the size of him that he's holding above the ground whilst sleeping standing up. Oh, Professor Rain. It, I'd be over? so impressed. I'd never tell him to do a thing again. <sighs> 
could have his way with me if he Let's wanted to. What, what can I do? Question. Genus, how about you? Yes, Rain. Teacher's pet. Mythos, the hero, brought about the end of the ancient war in the holy ground of Carlon. Correct. Afterwards, Mythos, the hero, formed a pact with the goddess Martell to seal away the Desions whom caused the war. A desire, the Desions. But the Desions <laughs> came back and are now causing everyone to suffer. We covered that in class last time, remember? You don't say it right. When oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> sometimes it's auto and sometimes it's press A. I, oh, no. Yeah, I knew that. <laughs> I, I just forgot. Today is the day of prophecy. See, like, that, that time I It is a very a. important day, which the Chosen of Mana will receive an oracle from the goddess Martell. Now, Chosen One, Colette. Your mind's Colette! Yes, ma'am. Tell us about the journey of world regeneration. This is a chain we'll never break. It is a journey to seal the designs. Upon passing the trials of the goddess Martell, summon spirits that protect the world awaken, and mana is restored. Mana? Correct. I suppose we Man should expect the Chosen herself to know the answer to that one. Mana depletion is the mana. cause of the current this game is shortages mana. and droughts. For most people, it's mana. I say mana. It is said that this occurs because the Desions consume vast amounts of mana in their human ranches. <laughs> that would have caught my attention, too. Not to let smile. Don't get it twisted. The human the ranches part. Has two <laughs> purposes, like, excuse me? To revive mana, as well as defeat the Desions. Now, for the next question. What was that? Hark! That's... Settle down. It would seem that the time for the Oracle has come. Indeed. I will go and check on the chapel. Everyone stay here and study on your own. Understood? <laughs> Not on your life. <laughs> Professor! I'll go with you. Who does she think she is? No, Colette. If it is the Oracle, the priests will come here for you. Like, who do you think you are, Colette? Wait here with everyone else. The Chosen? Yes, ma'am. Sickening. I have control! Let me through. During class, Rain said that when the Oracle comes, the Kruxic Crystal enshrined at the altar shines. So that light must have been emitted by the Kruxix crystal at the temple. Thank you for saying it twice, Janus. You're really smart, bud. <laughs> Did you see how she spun in that chair? The light was so pretty. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> Woo! Okay. I don't care about the rest of them. They look like normal people. Only the cool designed people. Will get my attention. Boy, where are you going? Don't tell me you're sneaking out. Rain will be mad. Get mad. I'm really curious to find out what really happened to Colette when she received the Oracle. They always talk about the Chosen of Regeneration and the Day of Prophecy, but no one tells us what really happens. But my sister said stay and study by ourselves. It's research, genus. Duh. That's just an excuse. So? An excuse is an excuse, right? Don't be so stuffy. <laughs> You're coming too, right? We're best friends after all, in case you forgot. Colette, wanna come along too? <laughs> He's nothing but a troublemaker. <laughs> huh? Um, okay. <laughs> Let me twist your arm about it. So, where to? Where else? That light! You're directly involved in all of this! Aren't you curious? Hmm... Are you curious about it? Of course! Okay, then I'll be curious about it too. Okay. <laughs> See? Dwarven Vow number four. Don't depend on others. Walk on your own two legs. She did not, by the way. Neither did Genus. <laughs> They're both impressionable. <laughs> Okay, then. Let's go to the temple. Let's go, bud. Regular Benjamin Bunny. 
Not the dwarven vows again. You always use those when you need an excuse. An excuse is an excuse. I said what I said. Kled and Genus joined the party. Um, okay. Okay. It'll be fine. I wonder if Freen's going to get mad at us. Don't worry. All we have to do is get back to class before she does. But wasn't Professor Rain going to the temple too? What if we run into her? <laughs> we'll be fine. Probably. I ain't worried about it. What's going on? It's awfully quiet. Where did everybody go? Go on! Father! Frank! Thank goodness you're safe. Frank, what happened to everyone in the village? They're all hiding. The Desayans invaded the village just a short while ago. Thankfully, no one was hurt. They passed through the village and headed for the temple. Why? Azalea has a non-aggression treaty with the Desayans. You mean that agreement where they don't attack the village as long as we leave the human ranch alone? <laughs> Thank you, Lloyd. Because <laughs> I didn't know. <laughs> yes. Grandmother said it's to protect me. Oh, there's Grandmother. Phaedra. It's Phaedra. <laughs> Phaedra is in the temple preparing for the ritual. Phaedra's in the temple? But that's where the designs... The priests are there with her. There's no need to worry. Well, thank goodness for the priests. Now, Colette. I know. I promise to fulfill my duty as the Chosen. Good luck, Colette. Lord Genus... You two should leave my daughter to her own business. Let her go alone. She'll be fine. She's the chosen. I'm worried about letting Colette go by herself. I'll go with her to the temple. <laughs> me too. Give me some personality, Lloyd. <laughs> but. <sighs> All right. Thank you. I'll wait at the house. Come back immediately if anything happens. Especially if you die. The village of Oracles is Elia. I like that you can see the students in there. You can save your game with this memory circle and blah 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 blah. I've played Kingdom Hearts before. I know how this works. <laughs>